our solar system, consisting of nine known planets that revolve around the sun, of which Earth is the third. Scientists theorize that there may be a tenth planet as yet undiscovered. But... At this moment, man has only set foot on the moon. Just the word dweeb doesn't mean anything to you guys, does it? I'm on Planet X looking for a dweeb who wears green fatigues, he wears this jacket, he's got long hair, it comes over his eyes, he wears glasses and <laughs> sneezes. Well, um, well, I mean, you just, I just had to learn how to pronounce it. I mean, it hasn't been a living spoken language in more than 1,000 years. I mean, look at this. It says, uh, a traveler from distant stars escaped from a dying world looking for a way to extend his own life body decaying and weak he couldn't prevent his own demise apparently his whole species was becoming extinct so he traveled or searched the galaxies looking for a way to cheat death and uh look here he came to a world rich with life where he encountered a primitive race humans <laughs> a species which with all his powers and knowledge he could maintain indefinitely he realized within a human body he had a chance for a new life. Now, he apparently found a young boy. It says, as the frightened villagers ran, night became day. Curious and without fear, he walked towards the light. Ra took him and possessed his body like some kind of a parasite looking for a host. And inhabiting this human form, he appointed himself ruler. He used the Stargate to bring thousands of people here to this planet as workers for the mines. Just like the one we saw, this mineral is clearly the building block of all his technology. With this, he can sustain eternal life. Now, uh, something happened, where is it, back on Earth? A rebellion or uprising, and the Stargate was buried there. Fearful of a rebellion here, Ra outlawed reading and writing. He didn't want the people to remember the truth. It's Yasu Shohan. 